Welcome back to the Novus Carpets pregame show on 1360 Radio KSCJ. We're joined now by Heelan Senior Joe Kale. And one way or the other, this is the last time you're going to put on these pads in Memorial Field tonight. What are your thoughts with this? Is This is the end. You know, it's a bittersweet moment all the time. I mean, uh, you just got to come out and be very prepared. And uh, I think we did a good job of that this week. And uh, we're going to have to come out, play our best, and hope for the best. You run routes uh, all over the field. And I've seen this field. It's torn up from a season of use. How does that affect you as a, as one of the skill, posi- skill position players? Yeah, I mean, uh, the field's pretty rough out there. You just got to you know deal with it. That's football. Is it noticeable to you? I mean, would you notice it if you didn't see the field? Oh, I mean, it's only when you're running on it, it's really hard, and just you know, when you fall down, you get skid up pretty good. So, Talk a little bit about this team. You guys uh, had the state championship last year. Now it's your turn to try to do that as seniors. What's been this senior class's identity? What do you, how do you guys define yourselves? I mean, I guess, I mean, we're we're not the team we had last year, but we definitely got skill. Um, we, we got guys that, I mean, we're not the same as last year, but we always, we do our own thing, you know. Um, just like any team, we're not going to be the exact same from last year, and um you know, we, we ran the ball great this year. I mean, last year it was all passing, and now we split it up to passing and running. Um, our defense is doing a great job. Talk about your your new quarterback this year. Comes in after having really never been part of the healing system and takes over and has done a phenomenal job. What's that been like? Yeah, Nick, uh, he, he learned really quick. I mean, we weren't expecting that at all. I mean, he picked up on the offense really well. He's a great athlete, you know. Um, he, he runs around really well. He throws a great ball and just knows the routes and what to read the defense. As a receiver, what's the toughest thing that you do? I mean, I just get tired sometimes, you know, running the routes a lot. Uh, other than that, I mean, it's just simple. When, you got, when you're back in the huddle and you hear a play that calls for you to run a route, and you know the ball isn't coming your way. Right. Uh, uh, you just, I mean. Can you, you dial it down a bit? Yeah, I mean, like, there's, there's routes that you're designed just to clear someone else out, and you just kind of want to, you know, go 50% on it, but you know you have to go 100% so that your guy next to you can get, get the ball caught. So. Have you had situations where you're running a route that you're trying to clear somebody, but all of a sudden you're the target? Yes, I've had that a lot, and it's quite surprising, actually, yeah. <laughs> do, you, do you have to change your mindset quick, or do you juke a yeah, guy? Yeah, I mean, well, you just, you're looking up, and the ball's right there all of a sudden, and then you have to catch it and go, or maybe drop it, but... Well, when, you, uh, when you're when you out there and you drop it, do the guys give you a hard time in the huddle? Oh, no, they're very encouraging all the time, you know. We're always, you know, keeping positive attitudes out there. What are the fans like here compared to uh, on the road? I mean, can you tell when you're at Memorial Stadium versus when you're at a, a, a road game with healing fans? Oh, absolutely. I mean, that's why we always made a big deal that we uh, keep winning the game so we during playoffs we can play at home because our atmosphere is so great. Our fans always come and support. Do you think that's worth some points? Oh, absolutely. It helps us sell a ton. You know, it gets us all pumped up and fired up before our games. We've seen this uh, this Carroll team before this year, uh, earlier. It was a heck of a ball game, kind of the tale of two halves. So that's got to be in your mind going out there tonight. Oh, yeah. I mean, they're a very good team. They've improved quite a bit since we played them, and it's always difficult to put, uh, beat a team twice. So. What are your keys to uh, success tonight? Well, we got to uh, we got to come out firing right away. You know, our, our offense has quite a few games come out slow, and we got to come out quick and um, – just do play the best game that we possibly can, in order to, that we've had all year. Now closing the chapter on the Memorial Field era and heading to the dome. Hopefully, Joe Kale, best of luck. Yep, thank you. That was Helen Senior Joe Kale, and we'll be right back.